Hi guys, I, uh, I figured I'd share with you today uh, a project I've been working on for quite a while in between doing other things um, and a project which is still in very early stages of development for reasons that will soon become apparent. So uh, this is a uh, mountain blade, a medieval uh, hack and slash. Uh, you can see that I'm controlling the shield using my left hand and the sword with swings on my right. Different directions do uh, do different sword swings. You'll probably notice the the camera jumping around quite a lot. That's because uh, Mountain Blade uses the mouse to determine which way you're going to swing your sword. Uh, so I've had to pass some uh, some direct inputs to to get that going because there's no way to control it with uh, button presses alone. Now it's all very well and good being able to do that, but uh, in order to to get this working, we're going to have to have some head tracking. Um, and as um, <laughs> an intermediate step, um, I've I've stuffed a Wii remote into uh, into a hat, uh, which which functions and which uh, serves the purpose of this uh, this this proof of concept. In the future, we should be able to uh, to replace that with uh, with with just some connect head tracking. And as soon as that becomes possible, I'll update this video with a, a new video that doesn't require a ridiculous hat. One of the key features to note is that on the chuck I'm using a look enable so that I can uh, centre my head again and uh, move my head freely without necessarily moving the camera. So one of the main features of Mountain Blade is the uh, mountain combat that you can, you can engage in uh, using a, a pretty unique system. Um, the only other instance of, of this sort of momentum based uh, sword swinging that I'm aware of is, uh, is Die by the Sword which is a really good game. I've added uh, a little lean feature there, um, which isn't in the, in the game originally, it's basically just uh, a, a direct input on the mouse which jolts uh, the camera in a certain direction to help you line up on targets. It's pretty crude because there's no way of actually bringing back the uh, the camera angle uh, from Mountain Blade into Glove Pie, um, but it does revert to, to where the mouse was um, before you started leaning when you, you, you sit upright again. So if you've played Mountain Blade before, you'll know that um, timing is pretty much everything, which is why I've taken this particular weapon and increased its speed by uh, about four times to, to help improve the uh, the response and bringing your arm forward, which isn't a lag that's caused by the connect, it's, uh, it's a lag that's caused by uh, the animation and, and simply the fact that Mountain Blade was never meant to be played this way. The main bug that remains in this is an issue which occurs when your mouse control from the head tracking uh, overrides the the mouse control from, from swinging your hand about. Um, it's probably just a timing issue. Uh, Infantry. I'm, I'm working on resolving it, but every now and again you get a, a, an inappropriate sword swing in the wrong Hold direction. Hold this position! So basically what this last section of the, uh, the video is showing is some Follow. voice control which gives out orders uh, in a similar way to uh, to the Rome Total War video that I did earlier. Again, um, I'm continuing to use a headset here because the microphone in Kinect isn't supported by the the official Hold drivers this position. that are currently available. Um, but as, uh, as soon as the, the microphone does become supported, then you should just be able to chuck away uh, the headset and use Kinect for, for that as well. I'm going to post up the uh, the various scripts for this, uh, for Glove Pie, Fast, and, uh, and VAC, uh, so you can have a go In yourself if you, uh, if you happen to have uh, a Kinect camera um, at a Wiimote. I'm not going to be uploading the Advance. part of the script which does the motion tracking on the Wiimote, um, simply because you have to be careful when you calibrate it so that you don't, uh, you don't jar your neck during Hold this play. position. Uh, I hope you've uh, you've enjoyed this video. It's been one of the most uh, complicated of all these uh, these integration attempts so far, um, and it's it's finally starting to to yield yield fruit, uh, even if it does require a silly hat at this stage. Please feel free to to post comments. They will be moderated, um, and any comments relating to the hat which aren't funny won't get published. Thanks for watching.